your son, he won't be a drug addict because he's becoming very bad. And now <coughs> already you are suspecting that he might be using drugs. Huh? True. Don't worry. Don't worry. God will help your son. You hear me? Because sometimes he goes away for many days and this is becoming a problem. Don't worry. The person who visits you at night is the one that is doing this. This issue of the spiritual husband. Come on! So I'm praying that God must save your son, the life of your son from this problem. Out! Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T. Imakananisa. And with me here today is my mother who received a prophecy from Prophet Andres Simono. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Mako Shamati Mulani, originally from Polokwane, but I stay in St. During the service, the man of God and located you and spoke to you. Kindly please tell us in detail what the man of God said to you yeah. and please confirm. The man of God said to me, uh, my son will not be a drug addict. I confirm it to be true. Since 2015, my son has been taking Dacha and um, he's now busy doing his uh, law degree. Since 2015, he's been... Every time when he's supposed to write his exams, he'll continue taking Dacha and he'll go psychotic and end up not writing his exam and write his exams the following year. And even now, he was admitted last year, I think times two, because every time towards around June or let me just say exam time, he'll just go psychotic. So I'll confirm what the man of God said, it's true. And how has this been affecting you as a parent? Yo, emotionally it drains and it doesn't just drain me emotionally, even financially. I'm into lots of debts because I take him to private sectors and sometimes I have, I have to pay the private doctors and uh, it put a very strain on me financially and emotionally. And how do you feel that today the man of God located you and spoke to you regarding a problem in your household? I'm actually glad because he's telling me for the second time. Last year he said I must stop worrying about him. But uh, every time when I see him going psychotic because it's very, very serious, you have to actually hold him tight and call the police. So that actually uplifted my faith today and I believe that Indeed, he won't be a drug addict. And what words of encouragement do you have for somebody who's currently watching this? Uh, I'll say we shouldn't give up on our children. It doesn't matter what they do. In return, we must love them unconditionally because there's always a negative force to be, be, uh, towards all these things that are happening. It just wants us to give up, and uh, I will never give up on myself.